considering whether upgrading to an iPhone 15 is wise in today's rapidly evolving smartphone market, the decision is no longer as clear-cut as before. While the iPhone 15 boasts significant enhancements over its predecessor, earlier models now offer compelling price advantages. The iPhone 13 stands out as a simple yet reliable option, while the iPhone 14 provides a slightly upgraded experience with enhanced cameras and new safety features from Apple. Consequently, the newest smartphone isn't necessarily the automatic choice anymore. Despite differing opinions on the entire iPhone lineup, we reach to a conclusion to assist you in making the best purchasing decision. In our comparison of the iPhone 15, iPhone 14 and iPhone 13, we'll delve into specific categories to help you determine which smartphone aligns best with your needs. For many, particularly in cost-conscious markets, Price often reigns supreme as the most crucial factor influencing smartphone purchases. Features like USB-C or satellite connectivity may take a backseat when budget constraints come into the play. Apple's transition to USB-C connector in its latest iPhone may seem significant initially, but the limited USB 2.0 speeds of the USB-C port hinder both data transfer and charging speeds, making its appeal less compelling. This limitation also applies to the Lightning port, now adhering to USB 2.0 standards. Thus, the USB-C port on the iPhone 15 Pro is beneficial primarily for users prone to forgetting chargers or transitioning from Android devices. However, for those heavily invested in Lightning port accessories, the iPhone 14 and the iPhone 13 offer better compatibility. Although carrying a Lightning charger remains a drawback, existing iPhone users are likely accustomed to this approach. Moreover, both models support wireless charging, with many users already owning wireless charging pads for convenience. Performance-wise, none of the iPhones hold a significant advantage over each other. While the iPhone 13 and iPhone 14 utilize the A15 Bionic chip, the iPhone 15 features the A16 Bionic chip offering negligible performance gains due to all models relying on 4 nanometers chips. If battery life is a top priority, the iPhone 14 Plus emerges as a compelling option, offering an incredible 2-day battery life. Despite its lightning port, its larger battery reduces the need for frequent charging, making it ideal for heavy users. While the iPhone 14 has garnered praise for its all-day battery life, Apple promises similar endurance for the iPhone 15. This isn't disappointing, considering iPhone 14 users have enjoyed prolonged battery life for a year now. Even the iPhone 13 delivered all-day battery life when it was first released, and with the latest optimizations of iOS 17, it continues to offer lasting power on a single charge. With careful usage, the iPhone 14 Plus can last up to two days on a single charge, making it the best choice for those prioritizing battery longevity. Despite its lightning port, the larger battery means less frequent charging compared to the standard iPhone 15. You might not even need to carry a charger or power bank outdoors, even with heavy usage. This is an area where the iPhone 15 is expected to offer the best experience among the models.
the new 48 megapixel main camera coupled with the improved image signal processor ISP on the A16 Bionic chip promises significant enhancement in picture details and low light performance. These improvements are likely to extend to videography as well. Essentially, you can anticipate camera performance similar to that on the iPhone 14. Additionally, the iPhone 15 introduces post-capture editing features in portrait mode. However, this doesn't imply that the cameras on the iPhone 14 and the iPhone 13 are subbar. Under favorable lighting conditions, both the iPhone 13 and 14 can compete with the iPhone 15 in the terms of camera quality. Even in low light scenarios, the iPhone 14 and 13 can maintain sharp subject focus, although the smaller sensor size may introduce some graininess. Moreover, the iPhone 13 lacks features like action mode and high resolution cinematic mode available on the iPhone 14 and iPhone 15. In the iPhone 15 versus iPhone 14 versus iPhone 13 comparison, our top recommendation currently goes to the iPhone 15. If budget is not a concern, the iPhone 15 offers an unparalleled package with upgraded cameras, a brighter display, USB-C charging and refined chipset. However, for those prioritizing better life and display immersion without necessarily needing the latest features, the iPhone 14 Plus presents a compelling alternative at a similar price point. Finally, the iPhone 13 remains a solid choice for individuals entering the iPhone ecosystem or upgrading from the older models particularly for those on a tight budget, with the added bonus of a variety of color options. My name is Mario, this is Exploramix. Make sure to like this video, subscribe to this channel and we will see you soon. Ciao!